Uh, first of all, I need to say sorry for playing Taros. So, uh, second of all, though, if you want to enjoy the video, I'd appreciate it a lot if you leave a like uh, and subscribe to you if you want. Both of those things help out way more than you'd think. Uh, I'd appreciate them a lot. Uh, but yeah, let's get into this. I was thinking about making a video on the new legend that kind of got revealed. I, honestly, I wouldn't even call it a reveal. It was just like a, a bit of a teaser trailer. Like, none of the weapons got revealed, none of the SIGs, none of the stats even, nothing like that. So, um, I thought it would kind of just be wasting your lot's time if I uploaded the video. Like, like what am I supposed to upload? A five second video going over the, the little reveal trailer that you can already watch yourself anyway? Like, uh, that just doesn't sound like content to me. So, uh, I thought instead I'll just wait until some, some more things come out about the legend, like actual interesting things. Like the weapon comp, um, or like, I don't know, anything more interesting than that because i think all we learned was that she's a girl and she's fang wild themed which i think we already knew she was fang wild themed anyway so yeah um but regardless i thought i'd just make a video about this which uh there's a reason i'm playing terrorist by the way before you do crucify me um wow 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 this guy this guy oh my god the movement oh, and it all meant nothing nice okay and the disc <laughs> i actually like physically cringed at that by the way that was that was awful i, I don't know what it is about playing terrors like, I've played a couple games to warm up before recording this, and, like, people are scared of this legend. Like, experimental is already, you know, passive enough, but, fam, people are just, they don't approach you if you're playing Taros. Which, maybe it's understandable, but it's kind of extreme, can't lie. Oh, that was, see what I mean? Like, they're <laughs> just so terrified. Anyway, um, so yeah, the, the point of the video is that, uh, and I mentioned this a bit before, uh, like a couple days ago, but I didn't really elaborate on it too much, so I thought I'd make, you know, a bit, go into a bit more depth on it. But um, I think it was last patch, BMG made a change, right, where they made it so that Axe and Air and Axe there apparently have less drift when you like use them like this, right, when you dash jump and you know you, you try and drift them. Apparently, it, it does it less, uh, there's less drift. Obviously, it, it does nothing, the, the change did absolutely nothing at all. Same with, they did the exact same change to Sword a while back, where they reduced the drift of um, Sword Nair and Sword there. Uh, so they did the same change to Axe, but the Axe one, for some reason, and make this make sense, but it, it, it literally you could feel it even less than on Sword, like a really light weapon. Um, so the nerf did quite literally nothing, like, I, like I'm saying. And uh, yeah, they decided to, to fix that. Um, and same with Hammond there as well. Uh, it also, supposedly, like look at this, man. So yeah, supposedly, like I said, they, they got rid of some of the drift on that as well. And, yeah, I just don't believe it. Um, so, yeah, like I said, next patch, uh, or it hopefully is next patch anyway, they said that they are going to change it and make it, you know, more meaningful. And if it actually does make, like, a substantial, you know, impact, and you can fuel it, and, and it makes the heavy weapons feel heavy, which they, like, they should do, right? Then, you know, that, that's gonna, I think, shake up the meta a bit. And fam, people have been crying lately about the meta go get your weapon I, I, fam, I, <laughs> please um but yeah like i said people have been like really crying about it the thing is though to me i don't think it's that bad at the moment like yeah loads of people are playing axe loads of people are playing sword i, I don't think axe and sword are where oh well, okay sword's kind of mad but i don't think axe is like some massively broken weapon it's just that a lot of people are playing it right now because it's kind of easy right uh, personally i find the matter okay i think everything is strong everything can win String weapons too. Katars are very strong right now. Gaunts, have, uh, Gaunts are always going to be strong. Scythe is really strong. Like, uh, like, I don't think there's too much to complain about. But like I said, people are heavily complaining. So, you know, people are talking about how like, oh, Brahla's dying. You know, they're, they're killing their game competitively. Like, wrenched and, and I can't think of other people. But yeah, t Twitter's a bit cringe at the moment. Um, like I said, they're pro. I'm not. So, you know, maybe there's something... Something going on there that I'm not aware of, but yeah, I mean, this could help them relax a little bit because, uh, you know, heavy weapons are the thing that people have been complaining about for so long now. And don't get me wrong, it, it's understandable because, like, th they're unbelievably easy to play, Axe especially, and you get so much reward for playing them. Like, it's not like they're, you know, easy to play, but that means they have, like, a low skill ceiling. Like, no, they, you can do insane on these weapons uh, and every tournament right now is basically getting won by axe players uh, and this guy has really just felt the, felt the, the, the true pain so yeah i mean in conclusion you know they can make like a like a pretty big impact 
with this change if they don't underdo it for the second time in a row, which I doubt they will. Because, like, they're going in for second, right? Like, they're going to make a change. Like, I, I would hope, anyway, I'd imagine so, that you're going to be able to feel it this time around. Like, they, they wouldn't do it again if they're not going to make you actually be able to feel the change. Um, so, we'll have to see. Also, no way that that just straight killed. I saved him. He grabbed my Jordans. I'm pissed. Um, but, yeah, uh, like I said, we'll have to see. But, I mean, I think... Because, like, people base their whole playstyle around, like, Axe Dare. Axe Nair as well. Like, yeah, that, that's been a meme for the longest amount of time. It's like, you know, you use all your jumps, use your recovery, use your dodge, and then land with it there. Like, that's a way people play this game. Um, and, and spamming there on Axe too is, is so effective. Um, so, like, yeah, it, like I said, there's, you know, it could make a good difference. Um, hopefully they don't overdo it, because it's not going to be fun. Like, if you actually main Axe, uh, you know, as much as you may hate Axe means, having, like, the fun sucked out of your weapons is, is just not good. Like, that's not good balance. So if they just make the moves unusable, then that's also kind of kind of cringe. But yeah, things like Hammer Nair as well are just way overused. Like, like it deserves this nerf, don't get me wrong. Um, and yeah, I mean, we'll see. It, regardless though, uh, of what happens, if it does make a change, if it doesn't, there's still going to be moves like Hammer and Light that exist. But okay, I, I don't know why I did End Light there. I got it in my own head by, by just speaking there. Oh wait, hold on, this guy's getting clipped. Okay, I don't think he's that. He's damaged enough. Yeah, he's, he's definitely not. Hold on. No, we were so close. <laughs> I'm so sad. I try to hit that every video. I get this map. It just doesn't work. Um, But anyway, yeah. Oh, how, that's there missed. Interesting. Little D-Sig. Hold on. Little D-Sig again. Okay. People actually... There we go. I was going to say, like, people always hit that D-Sig on me. But, you know, when I do it, it just misses. Like, they have 100% field goal percentage, but I just can't hit it. It's not fair how the world works, man. Come on now. Uh, but anyway, I'm finished talking about Brahalo, Meta, and Taros, and Axe, and Hammer, and all these things. So instead, let me just rant for a bit. Uh, if this is the last game, I don't know. Maybe I'll play another game too. But like, I'm in no rush today. I've had my Elden Ring fix already, so probably a bit longer of a video than yesterday. <laughs> Fully, Elden Ring is making my videos shorter. I don't even know if you lot have noticed that, but... I think yesterday's just like 10 minutes long or something. They usually, sometimes they go up to 20. Yeah, not anymore. Um, that's sad. Anyway, yeah. Uh, okay. So this can fully branch off into like 100 different thoughts. So hopefully I can keep it kind of focused. But I hate how like for some reason it's like a thing for all Europeans. And I'm not like a racist. It's going to sound like bad. But like, like French people, uh, pe like Dutch people. Eastern Europeans, like everyone, for some reason, is from the UK now. Why? Like, why is is UK slang just so intriguing that everyone? And it's like you know how people just type in in the way they want to sound, but it's like when you actually hear them speak, they don't sound like how they type at all. They don't use any of the words that they use when they type. Like that is f like it's becoming a, a true problem right now. It's the new pandemic, fam, and it's Europeans trying to sound like they're from from the UK. It doesn't make sense to me. Uh, but, yeah, like, I don't know. So many Brahalla players, too. So many people in so many Discord servers. Like, uh, you know, obviously, I mean, I'm in BOP, right? It's, it's majority of the players are all from London, all from the UK. Um, when people join the BOP server, for example, all of a sudden, they're from London as well. Like, literally, one guy who is, like, literally a Russian joined the server the other day. Uh, he just, just started chatting, like, like, uh, like, he's from the UK, fam. Uh, he's just, what the, Why? Leave the slang alone, please. Now, I'm not even trying to gatekeep anything, but it's like, if that's the way you talk out of your real life mouth, fine. If you use those words in real life, if you, if I'm in VC with someone, right, and they talk that way, that's, that's, that's completely okay. Whatever, you can type that way too. But why are you typing in a way that it's just like, you, you don't sound like that. You don't speak like that. So why are you typing like that? The same thing with people from the UK. Like, I'm not even just biased, right? This isn't, like, like a bias thing. But people from the UK, for some reason, there's so many of them that just want to sound like they're from America. Like, like you'll catch so many people from the UK typing in, like, some, some really cringe way. Like, bruh. Like, hey, yo. Like, ah, oh, it's so cringe. I, I hate it so much. And I know you know what I'm talking about. Because it's like, that's not even a thing that's, like, exclusive to the UK or whatever. Like, there's people in, in Europe as well as trying to sound like they're from, from London or whatever. They're, they're trying to sound like they're from, from Compton too. Like, using all, like, the, 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 I guess, ghetto American slang. 
it's like which they've never said in their lives like in the, in the real world just they type that way which is just so cringe to me like maybe i'm deep in it too much and like no one else really cares but it's just really weird like i've never cared uh, even like people in america will try and sound like they're from other places in america like little timmy from minnesota is typing like he's from compton like like from from the ghetto right he's just he's just not you know he's, he's in the he's in the suburbs he's he's, he's living living lovely it's just so cringe so cringe but like i've never noticed it right and that's why i think that like I, it's kind of annoying me more now it's because it's never been a thing before to try and you know steal uk slang and, and you know it's definitely it's because of like uk drill because like it wasn't ever popular before but now it's kind of popular so it's like people will listen to one drill track and all of a sudden what pierre from france is literally dutch or well, hopefully he's not dutch actually yeah that that definitely wouldn't be good um if you know then i guess you know but how am i not dead from that but yeah i, I don't know the whole thing is just really cringe it, same with people okay and this is i, f I swear this is a brahala player thing but like y you hear the phrase eu drill it, it's uh, like people refer to uk or to the uk even as eu which like that, that surely that's not a thing right that, like that's just a brahala player thing because of like the servers right but I swear, Brahala players, if I get called, like, or if I hear one, like, more UK thing be called an EU thing, like, it, 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 the UK could not be further apart from, like, Russia or from, from, from like, I don't know, where, where else? Like, France, the Netherlands, Denmark, like, do you, you think London is like all these places? <laughs> if you say EU drill, you're literally talking about Denmark, like, you're not talking about London. I, like I said, uh, I could rant. Rant? What am I? What am I? Jesus Christ. I could rant. Why did I say that so weird? About so many different things for so long. Uh, it's just. Yeah, let me relax before I get too worked. <gasps> okay, no, I, I definitely need to relax. Someone make that make sense for me, real quick. I know you saw that. I know you saw how that just phased through the ground to hit me. It's kind of cringe. Also, I, I feel like I've been playing so poorly. Because I'm literally just ranting about this, but you know, you lot probably enjoy. I swear, every time I rant about things, I'm like, no one cares. Everyone's like, oh, that was quite entertaining. So, whatever. Hopefully, you lot have enjoyed. <laughs> if not, you know, just unsubscribe, dislike the video, and leave a hate comment. If you did enjoy it all, leave a like, subscribe. You know, I'd appreciate that a lot. Like I said at the start, it helps. And um, yeah, back to Elden Ring. Hope you lot have a great rest of your days. And peace.